Hey guys, happy new year, how you guys doing? Uh, this, this is going to be a little informative, little celebration kind of video, more or less a little bit of everything. Uh, first of all, I want to go ahead and say happy new year's to everyone. So happy new year, happy new year to all of you guys. I want you guys to be safe out there, more or less, just be safe, have a good time. Uh, so happy new year's everyone. So, first things off I want to get to is, more or less, uh, a few changes that I've uh, found and wanted to do on my channel. Uh, pretty much, we're going to go into some resolutions, some New Year's resolutions that I, I have for this year. You know, this past year, I've, I found that I really wasn't very interactive with you guys. You know, I, I tried to be as interactive as I could, but I felt like I could be a little bit more interactive. And I've been trying to think of ways that I could do this, you know, creative ways that I could do it. You know, there's really not too many creative ways to actually do this anymore, as a lot of people have uh, done quite a few of these. But the biggest thing that I can think of is some type of chat, some way we can talk together, interact. You know, I, I was at one point doing live streams and I, I still will probably do some live streams my problem with that is is that you know I'm only limited to about like so many gigs per month and it's a it's a shared connection so like all my computers are on it and uploading and downloading so it's it gets to be pretty bad so when you're sitting there live streaming it eats up a lot of that bandwidth and it's hard for me to do that all the time so I was thinking to myself you know there's got to be another way for me to interact with you guys that would be a little bit easier on all of us and one of that one of those ways was a some type of instant messaging chat so uh, sorry about the background too guys you guys are going to be noticing the uh, thing is going to be getting brighter and darker it's just a little effect but uh, we will be getting to some video very shortly something you guys can actually look at but just listen for a minute if you guys would I'd appreciate it so anyways we have a uh, I'm going to make us a chat box that we can all go into I will do my best to be in there as often as possible some way for all of us to you know talk together you know maybe you guys can make some new friends you know more or less uh, and I, I feel like it would be pretty cool to maybe get to know some of you guys too so we'll see what happens and I will release that information down in the description below there will be a link to it uh, it is exact chat. It's an exact chat box. You don't have to register if you don't want to, but uh, you do need to click on your name. I would appreciate it if you guys did click on your name to like change your name, like whatever your screen name is, so that way I know who you are. Um, so next off, I want to go ahead and talk to you guys a little bit about you know my resolutions for this year, and this is going to be quick, and then we can get into the video. So more or less, my resolutions for this year are to make the best videos I can uh, lately I'm gonna be honest with you guys my Technic videos I've you know season two is pretty much coming to a close because you know I I feel like it's just time for it to, to end more or less it's it's kinda of dragging out to me and I'm ready to start something new something different and I I'm <laughs> just I just can't really see myself doing it much longer so it's it's not fun for me so I'm gonna try and do my best this year to make sure some stuff like that never happens and it's it's shown on a couple videos and I apologize for it and I want to do my best to make the best videos that I can for you guys because when you guys are happy it makes me happy and this is this is the reason why I do this is one of the biggest reasons because when I see other people that are happy and they can come up to me and say, you know, that was a that was a wonderful video. You know, I really appreciate it. You know, that makes me feel good. So that's pretty much number one up there on the list. The reason why I do this. If you guys are wondering why, so that's more or less the reason why I do this. And that's going to be my resolution this year. Now, there's a couple things that I've done last year, and we're going to go over them, and we're going to go ahead and start that up right now. So now we're going to go ahead and show off some of the videos that I've done for 2012, pretty much throughout the entire year. Uh, just uh, some variations of the videos, just to kind of go back through the memories of the year. Uh, this first one is a Modern Warfare 3 edit that I did of uh, an S&D team doing very well, and I was thinking, you know, 
about doing something like this for Black Ops 2. And it's still quite possible I might wind up doing something like this. So, next off, I <laughs> started a Skyrim playthrough, and this game was pretty fun. I, I, I gotta say, it was, it still is, I still enjoy it, and I have a number of hours in it still. And I got about 15 hours into my playthrough that I put up, and we gonna finish it soon when I say soon probably this coming year I want to make this one of my resolutions to finish this game this year but it's just really long so we're gonna try and hit it up sometime this year a very popular game with you guys uh, from me this year was Dead Rising 2 you guys are really enjoyed the game a lot of you guys enjoyed a lot of the beginning parts of it and I've really enjoyed it especially toward the end myself because it uh, took kind of a turn for the worst, and you know I kind of like sometimes things to do that it gives me challenges and kind of messes with your head a little bit. I've really enjoyed the the game so far, and we're actually coming to an end of it. So it's been a really good game this year. And uh, next off, we have some uh, zombies. Then I was <laughs> doing some just regular zombies. I was wanting to do a zombie survival guide, which is actually still possible, and I'm. Uh, just trying to debate on whether or not I want to continue it, but we'll see. It's a zombie survival guide, like how to survive in, you know, like the maybe like the basic 10 or 12 steps to help you survive in Call of Duty Zombies. So, uh, next off, we have Minecraft. This is uh, something of it's been very popular on my channel this past year with you guys. You guys seem to really enjoy my Minecraft videos and. This is actually uh, Mind Colony. This is when I first started uh, Mind Colony. The mod uh, had a lot to it, but finished in probably about 14 episodes. But it was uh, pretty good. On this next video, we got a little bit of Daisy. Daisy started to become big this year. This is 2012. Uh, it kind of became, I don't know, one of the better zombie survival MMOs, more or less, I guess. It's more the only one. And uh, it's it was pretty fun, you know, and it still is. And I might plan on doing some more of that with uh, Quick soon. So next off is a little bit of uh, Left 4 Dead custom maps. This is actually Deathcraft that we played this year. Me and Meat Wagon actually played this particular map here, uh, or this particular game actually. And uh, it was pretty fun. It actually took a lot of the aspects of Minecraft and put it into Left 4 Dead. So it was like a Minecraft shooter. It was pretty fun. Next off, uh, we also played Fear 3 this year, and it, it was uh, pretty short, you know, as far as posting up the episodes go, and I got a little bit crazy just for fun. I thought it would be cool entertainment for the video, but you know, it did look back to it. Some people found it annoying. You know, I did find it a little bit annoying at times, but it was a very fun video and playthrough myself, I thought. Yet, one of the biggest things this year that I've found was this. This is my Minecraft Journal series. I've only put out two episodes of this. I was very proud of it, but it didn't really seem like it got a lot of attention to it. And, you know, I thought maybe it would get a little bit more. My plans for this year is that I really want to continue this. So I do plan on continuing the Minecraft Journal series very, very soon. So you can expect Day 3 soon. Uh, another successful playthrough that we actually finished this year is actually, I believe, the first playthrough I've ever finished is uh, Fallout 3 on my channel. Or not Fallout 3, Fallout New Vegas, I'm sorry. Fallout New Vegas, and uh, it was really fun. I really enjoyed that game. I've put in over, I want to say, 200 hours into Fallout New Vegas, and we still got more to go. We still have all the DLC left to do, and you can expect that coming up this year. Next off, little another playthrough we finished off this year was actually Borderlands 2. We did it with uh, Guns, Meat, and his wife, Melees. It was pretty fun. Probably one of my favorite games of this year, past year, Borderlands 2. And is another game that I've actually put in over 220 hours on Steam myself, just uh, farming stuff. It was really fun. Uh, successful playthrough so far this year was Season 1 of Technic, and we had a whole lot of fun going out starting Technic out, finding this town, and we wound up <laughs> turning it into Bentville, which is this giant machine town, and uh, if you guys want to watch that, it's there's a playlist on my channel for that and a lot of the other games. Uh, another successful
playthrough we've done this year. Bioshock 2 is actually uh, completed, I believe, 34 episodes. You know, I probably could have did a whole lot more with it, but, you know, I completed it in 34 episodes. Not saying it was a speedrun or anything, but it was a very fun game nonetheless, and hopefully you guys enjoyed that. And this year we also started off another Minecraft, or this past year we started off another Minecraft mod pack. It was actually, or not mod pack, but it was a mod more or less. Uh, it was called Better Than Wolves, and it basically progresses through multiple tiers of ages where you start with wood power, then you start moving up to different resources of power, and it was pretty fun. Then this year, we, this past year, we, of course, all got Black Ops 2. Well, most of us did. At least I did. And here's my actual, my first impressions video, and, you know, I still stand by it. You know, I played Black Ops 2 probably a few weeks ago, and I still find it fun, and it's, it's a lot better than the previous ones that came out uh, lately, as far as, like, Modern Warfare 3 goes. So, I do enjoy Black Ops 2 a little bit more. And then here we are. Season 2 of Technic, because Season 1 was uh, pretty successful after 50-something episodes, 55 episodes or so. We started up Season 2, and we this time we went underground with it and started making our own underground area. It was pretty cool. Then I started playing a little bit of uh, War Z with Quick. If you guys don't know Quick, he's uh, one of my real-life friends here in uh, we just liked having fun in Daisy and War Z and Minecraft, and we just just have fun. So it's been a long year, guys, and I appreciate all of you guys. It's had a, a lot of different variety of content, so hopefully you guys enjoyed a lot of that. I do want to try to bring a lot of that in next year. So hopefully you guys enjoyed uh, walking down back memory lane with me. A lot of you guys have been here through this all with me. Some of you guys. You know, just started with me and I, I appreciate all you guys and I want to say thank you for joining me down that trip of 2012 going back and seeing everything that I've done all the variety and I hope that uh, this year we can do the exact same thing so hopefully you guys enjoyed I want to say happy new year's to everyone I want you guys to be safe have fun and we'll be back to our regular scheduled programming tomorrow so if you guys enjoyed Leave me a comment what you guys think. Hopefully you guys will join me uh, in Exat chat so we can maybe chat up sometime. And that's it for me, guys. And until next time, I'll see you then. Goodbye.